In this video lesson, I will try to answer how long to demo trade before going live on the trading platform on the trading Forex. Here on the left side, I have written an article about this topic where I will share more details about what is needed to go from the demo to live account and how long should you demo trade before going to the live account. Here are some of the smaller topics that I will cover in this lesson. Here on the right side, I have a MetaTrader 4 with the gold against US dollar on the one minute time frame, just in case uh, I will need to show you something directly on the tra trading platform. How long to demo trade? It's not easy to give you a precise answer because this all depends uh, on a trader. If you are fast learner, then you can quickly go from the demo account to the live account. If you are patient and disciplined, you can also go faster. But if you are not patient, if you are not disciplined, if you are greedy, if you have fear of trading or testing new things, going in something which is unknown, taking the risk, then it will take a longer time. Why is that? I will show more details later on during this video. But let's start from uh, let's start from the beginning. How long to demo trade? Here it is live as example. I will cover the list. But um, before I move forward, I just want to, uh, to tell you that moving from the demo account to the live account should not be too long and should not be too fast. What could be too fast? What could be too long? Too long would be half a year, a year on the demo account and too fast would be in a month or two months. You will see why. Well, how to uh, how, what is the demo account, first of all? A demo account is something that it is virtual. For example, here on my trading account, here on the balance, I have $7,800, which is very close to $8,000. It is a demo account, which means I can spend everything and I can test on this trading platform and nothing will happen. When I spend all the money, I simply go to the broker website where I open this account. I simply open a new account with starting uh, balance at which um, which month I would like to have. It depends on me. I have started with 10,000, so I can start immediately with 10,000. I even do not need to spend all of this money on my account. I can reset and open a new demo account without any issues. So this is virtual money. You can spend everything that will happen. This is not live, this is not live money, real money. So do not pay attention to that and do not worry about that. This is the difference between the uh, demo account and the live account. A live account is when you invest money, you put here on your broker account a money, he will put this on your trading account here on the trading platform, and then you can trade the money. So what is trading? A trading is, for example, you can see this is the price where each of this candle represents a one hour because I have here put on one, one hour time frame. You can see that here. You can also change this one to the four hour or any other of these here. And then when one hour closes, the next candle open. And then that moves on and on and on. And this is from Monday to Friday. You can see that how this goes. So for example, if you go to the daily time frame, this white candle is one day, which means yesterday. Currently, this is the current day where the price opened here at the start. And currently it is here, but the maximum price the price has gone is right here just as this is the short introduction. Now, the demo account and also a live account, especially the demo account will allow you to test everything. So you can see when the price goes up, you need to define where the price will go in the future. Will it go up still or it will go down? So this is something that you need to decide. That's all when trading what you need to do. If you decide correctly, you will make money. If you, do, if you do not decide correctly, you will lose money. So your goal is to make money and not to lose too much if you need to lose. But eventually, at the end, it is the best to be in profit at the end of the day or end of the week or end of the month, depends on you. Now, when you have decided, if you decide that the price will go up, that means you could make money and your account balance will be increased, which means after that, after a certain amount of time, you can withdraw this money on your bank account from your broker. And that's all what is, uh, what are the steps to do on a Forex trading. Well, how to decide this, where the price will go up and down, this depends on you, on your trading system. You need to find some kind of call it edge or the trading system, which will give you a trading rules when to enter, where to exit, where to put stop loss, 
to prevent your loss being too uh, too large and then how to prevent being a loser which means how to not open bad trades so your goal is to be at the end uh, in profit now a real life example is for example if you are driving and you're play, uh, playing with the games you are driving a car you can hit that car as much as you want and then you can just reset uh, the game and start again in a, in a real life example you cannot do that because you will need to spend more money to fix the car and you need to pay attention not to hit someone or not to finish uh, not to be uh, closed in jail because of the bad um, bad things do done with the car so this is something what is difference in a game you can do whatever you want you can uh, modify you can test and that is the same and it's demo account whatever you do you can reset and start again the life the real uh, real account with live money is something if you spend the money you lose the money if you want to start again you will need to invest more money so this is what is the difference between the demo and the live account the list for the demo trading you will see here what are first steps when you when you start to trade when you start to learn how to trade there are certain steps that you need to learn first first of all is to learn what is the trading tool the trading platform in this case metastrade 4 metastrade 5 or any other the broker can give you you need to understand how to prepare these charts whenever you open a new chart for example like this you will get this kind of a window so is it easy for you to analyze the market and to understand what is happening it's not very easy so that's why you need to learn how to prepare the chart how to prepare just a minute, how to prepare the analysis that you will make on this uh, trading platform on this trading symbol then how to use these all, all of these tools in this quick access toolbars and then how to start trade how to open new order for example when you open a new order what is the volume what is the stop loss what is the take profit what is the type of the execution and what means sell or buy these are all the forex basic terms that you need to learn on trading platform then you need to understand how what are the forex basic terms and that means what means when i say what is a lot what is a pip what is the margin what is the leverage and this is something that you will test everything while learning on a demo account so when you learn all of these all of the basic terms and also the trading platform the next step would be make a trading system which is a trading strategy that will tell you when to open a buy order which means a buy order means you are expecting the price will go up or when to open a sell order which means the price will go down and then when to exit from those trades this is the trading system with the certain rules that you need to follow and it will tell you what will be the risk per each trade which means if you open the trade for example a buy order where the loss will be accepted if the price goes against you will you exit from your trade when the price reaches this price level or this one here this is also the trading system that will tell you so that is why it is very important to have a trading system in the long run when you are following a trading system it will tell you are you in profit on your or in loss so when you uh, journal your trades with your trading system you can go back in the past and see what works what doesn't so what something that doesn't work you leave that out and increase the number of trades that are profitable so this is the trading system or trading strategy that you uh, need to have in order to start trading so here it is these are the steps i had just covered which tools you need how to open and close the order and then trading system the learning process while demo trade well the learning process will depend on you it is the best always to have a trading mentor that will show you all the details very quickly and to speed up the learning process if you do not have a trading mentor it will take a long time for you to understand what are the basic trading terms and how to use them especially to make a trading system so if you are starting on your own it will take months until you learn all of these and while learning it is the best to learn on the demo account one thing that is very important to understand is while while you are learning then when you start trading with a trading system you will trade that on your demo account and especially you will start learning and you will see a good results on the demo account 
This is usually a normal way that you are in profit on a demo account. And then you will try to go to the live account because you will see that the trading on a demo account is very easy and you are in profit. This is the demo not to trade too long. Why? Especially what I have just said. If you learn on your own, it will take too long. And when you start being profit on a demo account, you will like to move to the live uh, on a demo account. You will try to move to the live account. So this switch should be uh, not too long. What I have said, not too uh, not not too long, and that means years. It should be after several months after you have already tested that your uh, training system is working and you are in profit on a demo account. But when you start with a live account, try with a small amount of money. Try with $10 just to see how this goes. If you have a trading system, you could increase that $10 or at least start with $100. This will not be too much if you are losing all of that from your trading account. But what means if you have a trading system that is profitable on a demo account, it will be also profitable on the live account because the only thing that you are changing is is it this is the virtual money or is it live money everything else is the same so the trading system the price you can see on the trading uh, platform will be the same there are no difference but what is what is the trading on a live account well here it is something that i would like to um, talk about first I want to give you insight what you can expect during demo trade, but in a way where demo trading cannot help you. It is the part you can learn only while tra trading on a live account. Think about like driving, how, how to drive the car. When you are driving driving school, you are learning all the rules you must obey while driving. You also learn the basics about the car. But when you sit down in the car by yourself, then you see what you have not learned in the school. You have to think and react on different situations during the drive. If you, if you were in that situation, that means you have seen that there are some things that you need to pay attention while you are driving on yourself. There are no trading, uh, driving uh, personnel that will tell you, wait, stop, obey, check, go faster, go slower. There is, there is no one that will tell you. This is something that you will need to, to do on your own. And this is the same on a live account. When you are starting after the demo account on a live account, there are some things that you will not experience on the demo account, but you will experience on the live account. And those are emotions. When you see your money going up and up and up on a live account, you will be very happy. But then there is some kind of, that is something that uh, that is called greed that will step in, that will force you and try to trick you to go open even more trades with a larger lot size, which brings more risk on the trading that will try to force you to open more of them just to earn more and more. But this eventually leads to completely wiping your trading account. These are the emotions that will trick you. They are also called emotion fear that will, uh, that will step in, that will not allow you to close the trade because of the fear that you could lose all the money on your trading account. There is also fear that will f uh, prevent you from opening a new trade because you will have fear if you open a trade account, it will be a losing trade. So you will not trade at all because of the fear. These are the emotions that are that are step in when you are trading on a live account. So if you start small with a $100 on your trading account, and if you, lo if you lose that amount of money, compared if you are trading on a demo account where you will be in profit, you will lose those $100, which will not be too much at the start. So you will see what is the difference on a demo account and what is on the live account. So it is very important to learn about yourself. While trading on a live account, you will see how you are reacting on a trading, on a trading on the news, on uh, when the trade is in profit, when the trade is in loss. This will be everything visible on a live account. Demo account will not show you that because you understand that you, you can spend all of your money and you can simply reset and start over again. But on the live account, when you know that you are losing your own money that you have invested, that you have worked it for hard, hard work it for it, it will force you to be more cautious, being more greedy. There will be more fear in trading that will prevent you from being profitable. But that is why you need to have a trading system that you will follow and there are certain rules, trading rules that you will follow. 
That's why it's very important to create a trading system on a demo account before going to the live account and then you can try to test that. You will learn how you are reacting on, um, on a real trades when you are in profit, when you are in loss. This is something that will teach you is it are you a trader that is it is disciplined and patient or you are a trader that cannot uh, follow the, your own trading system certain rules that you have set in front of you well here are the steps how to move from the demo to, to from the demo account to trade on live account it's well invest small amount of money and that is what i have already explained invest half of your investment at the start so instead of $100 invest $50 and try how it goes if you earn $50 then you will have $100 then you can invest the rest of the money that you have uh, saved any investment should pay off so whatever you invest on your trading account on a live account if you invest $100 and you lose all of those $100 this investment should pay off what that means even though you have lost hundred dollars you should learn from those lessons that you when you have lost all hundred dollars what have you made wrong what the trading decision have uh, made you losing all hundred dollars learn everything from that write that down and then do not repeat the same mistakes again those are trading mistakes over trading over sizing uh, being greedy those are all the um, reasons why you lose all that money so start learning about yourself start improving yourself and start following your training strategy being disciplined and patient then do not lose the reason for trading well during your trading on the demo account maybe it will uh, take too much too long but do not lose your um, goal why have you started trading on the forex why have you started learning if you are seeing that this takes too long trading on a demo account try to start with small investment on the live account which will give you satisfaction that you're trading for the money for real money so starting with a small amount of money and not trading too long on the demo account will help you eventually but if you are patient and disciplined uh, trading on a demo account until you are completely profitable is the way to go money and the only money is should not be only the reason why you are trading i know that all the traders come to trade on the stock market on the forex market crypto market on any other market just because of the money you want to earn money but remember that when you will learning on the demo account and a live account how to trade being profit you will learn a lot a lot about yourself how disciplined you are how patient how to spot these uh, for example patterns that that forms on the chart these are all the things that will improve your you as a person that will eventually uh, be um, how to say that it will be profitable for you it will be very good for you that you have learned all of these things about yourself and also about how to trade on the markets now this should be also one of the goals how to be how to increase uh, how to learn about yourself how to improve yourself in some of the ways and not only trade for the money eventually we all trade for the money but this should not be the only reason because if you lose everything from your trading account this could be potentially one of the reasons why you will stop completely trading not focusing on the long run how to be profitable now here it is one of the things that I have put here to give a good answer how to uh, how long to demo trade if you are profitable use same account size on different accounts on the micro mini account hundred dollars five hundred dollars thousand dollars for a few weeks the goal is to see how you will behave when there is volume that do not give you enough money that means if you start trading with hundred dollars and the profits will be a cent a dollar a two dollars will that be good enough for you to to be disciplined and patient until you invest more money or uh, or earn money from hundred dollars if you are not patient with hundred dollars you will not be patient with a thousand dollars so this also pays uh, this gives you also one of the insights about you are you patient and are you disciplined so how do you behave on hundred dollars if you behave correctly then you will have much more chances of being successful on the larger account with thousand dollars or ten thousand dollars well this is all here it is one of the conclusions you can read also for yourself but i would like to tell you that start trading on a demo account should be 
mandatory and you should uh, test everything on the demo account first before going to the live account do not to do not trade on the demo accounts too long because it will be boring and you will need to move to the live account with a small amount of money just to test your emotions how do you feel how do you react on a loss and also on the profit while on a live account there are traders that likes to trade on the live account without learning on a demo account I also I also was one of one of the traders that wanted to test as soon as possible the live account with live money because I wanted to see how this works so I started with a dollar with ten dollars uh, and I think I think it was 13 or 14 dollars whenever I have lost this I have uh, invested again the same amount of money I didn't want to invest too much without being protected that means having a proper trading system which way you will go having a trading mentor is also one of the useful things but if you would like to learn on yourself it will take much longer you will learn from your own mistakes which will be also which, which will also uh, give you more time to learn and to improve improve yourself i hope this has shed some of the light to see how to how long to demo trade when to go to the live account how on what to pay attention to when you start trading on a demo and also on the live account and if you have any questions feel free to leave a comment i'll try to answer as soon as possible if you like this video click the like button and subscribe share with other traders if you think it will it will be uh, it will be helpful see you next time and happy trading